going to be my monthly favorites video for the month of July. If you guys would like to see what I favorited this month, then just keep watching. So I'm just going to jump right into it. And my first are these Vital Sassoon Pro series. These are the moisture ones. This is the shampoo and the white is the conditioner. And as you can see, these are like gigantic bottles. But these are only $5 each, which I was expecting for, especially like for the size bottle. I don't know, like $10, $15, something like that. They are from the drugstore as well. I did buy these from Walgreens, but I thought $5 was a really good deal for each of these. And it says, let's see, hydrating, moisture care for soft and silky hair. And these just work so well. My hair feels so much healthier with the shampoo. And I, I honestly, like with a lot of shampoos, I don't really feel or see too much of a difference when I like I try certain shampoos that are supposed to like you know like frizz or shine or just like hydrating but these ones really do work very well and I'm super happy with these especially for how affordable they are so yeah the Vital Sassoon Pro series I definitely would recommend to you guys. Um, next I also bought this at Walgreens this is Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Refreshing Dry Shampoo, instantly instant results, absorbs excess oils, it cleans without water, and it leaves a light matte finish. I love this. Dry shampoos, I don't know, I feel like I have like a kind of love, pretty much hate relationship with. I just feel like none of them work for me, but this one works way better than the ones at least that I've tried. I have tried quite a few of these. I give this like probably like a 7 out of 10, which is good for me because I give almost all of the other ones I've tried like 5 or 6 out of 10. This will last me a couple of hours where anyone I've ever tried will last me like an hour. So I do love this compared to all the rest that I've tried. And I just, you know, same thing with all of them. Just like shake it, apply it. I wait a few minutes and then I just kind of like rub it in and brush it out. And it smells really good. It just smells really fresh. So I definitely like that about this product. Next by Walgreens, these are absorbing sheets for an oily face. And I just absolutely love these. This is the only kind that I've tried, the Walgreens brand. But they work really well. Um, 50 come in a pack and you have to be kind of careful because when you're pulling them out a lot of times like a couple come out at once so you just want to make sure that you aren't wasting them and taking a bunch of them out and I just kind of like hold them for a second or two on my forehead I do down like the center of my nose even on my cheeks just all over and it absorbs so much excess oil I can't even tell you these are like a lifesaver for me and I love these next by Milani, this is the Runway Eyes Fashion Shadows, and this can be used wet or dry. I haven't tried it wet yet, but I do really enjoy this. I've worn it quite a few times, and I just really like the tones in here because a couple of these ones have like a reddish pink undertone, and I think that's so beautiful, so I'm loving this. And then this is the L'Oreal uh, Telescopic Shocking telescopic shocking extensions mascara and this is in brown black I just really love this because of the wand it's like I don't know it's like a rubber wand if that kind of makes sense and I just feel like the wand holds onto my lashes and just like pulls them with the mascara instead of like a typical wand if that kind of makes sense so I just feel like it works really well however this is hard to take off I take off my makeup every night with like a pawn wipe and it won't come off you have to definitely take out an eye makeup remover for this product next by Milani this is their number 16 flirty fuchsia and this is a really beautiful like pinkish red purpley color I don't even know but it looks like this and it's just really bright and beautiful I am in love with this color I also really enjoy the fact that they put a swatch on the bottom and as you can see it is pretty true like yeah especially on camera those look exactly alike so I also I mean just swatches on the bottom are awesome because you don't have to like open all of your tubes to find it it's right there so it saves a lot of time and next you guys know I love these these are the Maybelline color whispers and this is in number 30 pinup peach I'm actually wearing this on my lips right now I just love these because they are so hydrating and it's not as intense as like the one that I just showed you guys um, but they're just really hydrating and they're just so beautiful I love them I also really like this color because it's like a as you can see it's I don't know it's like not a red but it's not a pink it's like 
ruby pink if that kind of makes sense. Next is a Milani baked blush. This is in color 05 Luminoso and I'm obsessed with this. Obviously it's like a pink color but it's, I don't know, I just feel like it's like a really pink shimmer and it's so beautiful as a highlight so I am obsessed with this. Next by Maybelline, this is their Dream Lumi Touch Highlighting Concealer and I honestly put on like a different one first and then I put this one on top just because this one, it doesn't give you a lot of coverage I feel like but it just, it's really pretty. It has not like a shimmer to it but it just, I don't know, it like really highlights under my eyes. And it's the kind where you just like spin it right here and then it comes out of a brush and you just kind of like tap it on, brush it on, whatever you want to do and just blend it in. So this is awesome and I love this. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.